Welcome back to KTV Knife Television. Guys, this video is a little bit different from what you're used to. But I hope this helps. If this helps at least one person, I did my job. So check this out. Here before you lies the Ator Jungle King 1. Amazing survival knife. It had that aluminum handle. It was the only thing I really didn't like about this knife. So you know what I did? I wrapped it with a bicycle inner tube. Look at that. Now it just feels so much better, and I can't wait to get out there and put this thing through the ringer again. Hey, you just don't have to, you know, this isn't just for wrapping a knife handle. If you could find a, you know, inner tube that'll wrap your favorite tool, it'll work on that too. So guys, I'm glad you're here. Uh, I'll show you how to do this in four easy steps. And don't forget to subscribe, right? And if you want your own shout out, you know, send me a 10, 15 second clip and I'll get you on here. Just say, I want my KTV. Shout it from the rooftops. All right, so let's get to it. Four simple steps. How to wrap that rascal. <laughs> One, you might need a measuring tape. Unless you can guesstimate. You're definitely going to need some scissors. You're going to have to find an inner tube that the width will fit over your tube. I can't guess that for you. I can't figure that out. I had one that I tried to use earlier, and it was too thin. So I needed to uh, get a, a, a wider inner tube to fit over this bad boy. And that's it. So find your tool, measuring tape, scissors. And your inner tube. Today we're going to be sleeving up this $10 budget blade from Harbor Freight. Harbor Freight. So stand by. Be back in a second. Sunday, Monday, KTV. Tuesday, Wednesday, KTV. Thursday, Friday, KTV. Saturdays, every day. KTV for you. Fonzie says, hey, you ain't cool if you don't watch KTV. I decided to take this project outdoors. You can't pass up a day like today. Mid 50s in March. Well, first week of March, but still. I guess I guess it's the calm before the storm, right? Does that mean we're going to get a heavy snow later this week? This is when people get sick. All right, so anyway, I got all my tools, right? I got my budget $10 uh, Ader Jungle King clone from Harbor Freight. And uh, here's the... Uh, here is the Aider. One more time. Aider. <laughs> and yes, it feels so good. Now, I'd love to be able to wrap this bad boy. All right? But I don't think this inner tube is going to fit. I will try it. When this video is over, I'll give it a whirl. If not, going to need a bigger tube, so keep that in mind. I did attempt to do this one with another inner tube, but I think it was for like a 10-speed bicycle. It was just too thin. I couldn't, you know, of course, take off the handle. You know that, right? I couldn't get it. Uh, it just started to tear on me as I was trying to stretch it down the, uh, you know, the handle shaft here. All right, so let's get to it. I got my tool. I got my measuring tape, got my scissors, and I got my tube. 
So these handles are pretty much the same size. So this tube should do the trick. All right. Let's get a quick measurement. As I said, you might not need the measuring tape. You know, you can guesstimate. So what we got here, we want about four and a half inches. All right. So let's take this off here. Any surprises? Yeah, that, that thing's stuck in there. Um, okay. Four and a half inches. Let's get rid of this uh, this part right here. Not going to need it. All right. Guys want to fast forward to the end, you can. All right. Let's see my mark. Here we go. One quick little snip. I see you. Let's put this back in its sheath because this is pretty sharp. So, you know, you guys got to be very careful when handling sharp objects. It's funny, this uh, piece of tube that I cut off says A57 right here. We're going to keep it. This is just in case if anybody ever steals my $10 knife, I'll know it's mine because of the A57. All right, come on. Let's get on there, buddy. La da 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 dee da da. Yep, just give it a little pull and kind of, you know, work its way down now. See? Yep, thank God I got that sheath on here. There we go. Feels better already. Now, would you look at that? Little minor adjustment down here. It got a little wrinkled, but that's okay. All right, back with its cap. I'm telling you, these will make your knives and tools feel so much better, especially if you're dealing with those hollow handled knives. You know, I haven't had attempted on any other. So with this now being on the ATOR, yeah, yeah, life is good. Guys, if this helps, you know, one person, I did my job. All right, this thing's pretty awesome. Now I feel like uh, chopping something. But I'm going to see if I could uh, do this axe next, and I'll let you guys know how that turned out. That's it. Thanks for being here. And remember, you want your KTV? Send me in a clip. 10, 15 seconds. Be original. You know, and uh, we'll get you on. All right. Take care. Stay safe as always. And uh, see you in a couple days.